This morning, the World Health Organization is out with what appears to be a troubling headline about the artificial sweetener aspartame. It's commonly found in diet sodas, sugar-free gum, and tabletop sweeteners. The WHO's International Agency for Research on Cancer is now classifying aspartame as a carcinogen, meaning it's capable of causing cancer, specifically liver cancer. But the agency warns more research is needed. Many experts here in the U.S. are highly critical of the report. And I think that it's, it's unfortunate that IR puts this out because they're really not involved with the actual of safety assessment of substances and this is only going to add to confusion and alarm in the public and it's totally unnecessary. The FDA saying scientific evidence has continued to support the FDA's conclusion that aspartame is safe for the general population. Aspartame has been widely used since the 1980s. Experts say this report does not mean people should change their lifestyle as long as they consume only a moderate amount of aspartame. So how much is safe? The WHO says the acceptable daily level for a person weighing about 155 pounds is the equivalent of up to 14 cans of diet soda per day. I think the main thing is, is that aspartame is a safe substance, can be consumed in quite large amounts, much larger than the humans generally consume. To be clear, no doctor would say 14 cans of soda per day is good for your health. We're only talking about aspartame levels. The American Cancer Society says it welcomes more research on the issue. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.